50000 $50,000 is the number the Eastburg Volunteer Fire Brigade still owes on its purchase of a newer fire truck. Ladder 7 came from New Jersey in September of 2008, after that state received a grant to purchase a brand new fire engine. Even though Burke didn't have the money, their old truck was in complete disarray, so the town took out a loan while one town official came up with a creative way to slowly pay it off. Well, last year we raised $628 toward the ladder truck. I mean, it's not a huge amount of money, but it's less money that the fire department has to raise. And this year I'm hoping that um, we can raise 650 so, I mean, if we can do that every year and a little more each year, that'll all go, go towards paying for the ladder truck. That money came in part from residents purchasing Beanie Babies for $1 and $2 apiece, though those Beanie Babies are the lucky ones. They are the leftovers from when the town sent over care packages to Burke troops fighting in Iraq. Before those troops came back last December, Beanie Babies were used to give out to Iraqi children affected by the war. I think it meant something to them, you know? I mean, their lives are very, very hard. They're, everything is in turmoil. They don't have anything. They don't have anything. So just, and Beanie Babies, that's a universal language. You don't have to speak English to understand a Beanie Baby. While Kathy is holding down the donation fort at Town Hall, the owners of the Eastburg Garage, which includes the first assistant fire chief, are also collecting donations for the cause. Sources close to the fire department say that it's been difficult to pay back the loan, but that these fundraising efforts, like purchasing Beanie Babies, help greatly. I mean, they're so cute. They're just so sweet. Even grown-ups like Beanie Babies. So, it's the universal language. Justin Chenette, News 7, Burke.